Managing Files and Folder Windows is an operating system developed by Microsoft. The first version of Windows was Windows 1, which was released on November 10, 1983. It is a graphical user interface, GUI-based operating system that enables you to start the system, manage various devices, administer your files, and allocate computer resources judiciously. Windows is an operating system that acts as an interface between the user and the hardware. Windows is also managing all the resources of a computer system and provides common services for the other software. Windows has a unique quality to keep track of information regarding all creation, copy, storage and deletion of files. Windows 7 is a GUI-based operating system developed by Microsoft. It is designed for personal computers. Windows 7 was released on 22nd October 2009 for public use. The first GUI version of the Windows operating system was Windows 95. Since then, many versions of Windows have been released like Windows 98, Windows 2000, Windows XP, Windows Vista, Windows 7, Windows 8 and Windows 10. Features of Windows 7 Windows 7 became very famous and popular because of its user-friendly features. Some of the popular features of Windows 7 are given below. Speed Windows 7 is faster than the previous versions of Windows. It has a shorter boot time than previous versions. Compatible Windows 7 is more compatible than previous versions of Windows. All the software and hardware that support Windows Vista are also compatible with Windows 7. Lower Hardware Requirement Windows 7 needs very few changes in the hardware. That is why it is supported by multiple hardware bundles. Start Menu Windows 7 launched with the updated Start button and menu that provides the access point for programs and applications on your computer. Taskbar and Notification Area Taskbar in Windows 7 mainly contains four components Start button, Open Programs, Quick Launch Bar and System Notification Area. Windows Snipping Tool Windows 7 includes an application to capture, save and share screenshots and snipped images directly from your desktop. Windows Explorer Windows Explorer is an application that provides detailed information about files, folders and drives. You can use it to see how your files are organized and can copy, move, rename and search for files and folders. Follow the steps to open Windows Explorer. Click the Start button, All Programs, Accessories and then click Windows Explorer. Or click the Start button and select Computer option from the right pane. You will get the Windows Explorer window. File and Folders You must be having a wardrobe or almira in your room for keeping your things properly. A hard disk is similar to that wardrobe without any racks. A huge storage space but no divisions to organize things properly. That is the reason a hard disk is divided into smaller storage spaces called drives. Each drive has a name associated with it. You can create your own folders in these drives to keep different types of files separately. A file is a collection of some related information that is stored on the storage devices. A file has a name with the type of extension in it. A folder is a storage area where we can keep our files and other folders in it. Similarly, a folder has also a name on it. Creating a folder you have read that a folder is storage space on the hard disk to keep files. A folder may contain more folders called subfolders. Follow these steps to create a folder. Open Windows Explorer as shown. Click on any of the drives shown. Click on New Folder command in the command bar to add a new folder to the current drive as shown. Give the new folder a name of your choice Save my files and press enter. Creating text file in a folder. 
when you open the new folder my files that you have created you will see that it is empty it would be good to add some files to it remember that you can always add more folders to it using the new folder command in the command bar follow these steps to add a text file to the empty folder right click in the content area to open a menu as shown take your mouse to the new option to open a list of new items that you can create click on the microsoft word document option to add a new document to my files folder rename the file double click to open it and start writing in your document you can create a file of any type from the list shown in figure opening a file or folder after creating a file or folder open the respective file and folders by double clicking the left mouse button on the same renaming a file or folder rename is the facility by which the user can rename the file as per his or her requirements you can rename the file or folder at the time of creation or after creating a file or folder follow the following steps for renaming the file or folder open windows explorer as shown click on any of the drives shown right click on new folder a pop up menu will appear click on the rename option give the new folder a name of your choice say my files and press enter your folder will open with a new name same as with the folder you can rename any file in windows 7 select multiple files or folder more than one file can also be selected for bulk operations you can select multiple file and folder in two ways for selecting adjacent files or folders click on the first file or folder press and hold down the shift key and click on the last file or folder all the files or folders will be selected release the shift key or you can select all the items by clicking holding and dragging the left mouse button for selecting non adjacent files or folders press and hold down the control key and left click on the file or folders to be selected all the files or folders will be selected release the control key deleting files or folders the old and unwanted files should be removed from the system to delete any file or folder follow the given steps select the file or folder by left click on it press the delete key from the keyboard or right click on it and select the delete option from the drop down menu that appears copying and moving files or folder windows explorer assists in moving your files around from one folder to another there are two options when transferring the files you want to retain the original file and just want a copy in the new folder this is called copying the file you do not want to retain the file in its original folder this is called moving the file follow these steps to copy a file right click the file in its folder select the copy option from the menu displayed browse to the destination folder right click anywhere in the content area select paste option from the menu displayed follow these steps to move a file right click the file in its folder select cut option from the menu displayed browse to the destination folder right click anywhere in the content area select paste option from the menu displayed go back to the original location to check that the file is not there anymore you can drag and drop files in windows explorer 2 follow these steps to drag and drop files to copy or move them select the file in the content area keeping the mouse left button pressed drag the mouse to the destination folder in the navigation pane if your folder is within a drive hold the mouse pointer on the drive to open the folders within it repeat this with folders till the destination folder is reached release the mouse in the destination folder if you want to copy it 
press shift and then release the mouse if you want to move the file.